Is this turn? This is turning into Outlast. I don't even feel like I'm playing Void Train anymore. Well, it looks like we're going to be starting this video at a weirder point than I thought I was going to, right at the arena segment, so that means it's going to cut to music and me not really saying anything in, like, times to speed, because my mic was muted for the first part of this. But I guess that's okay, because I didn't really say much. We kind of just pushed the train forward and hit here. This is the first thing we're doing. So, I will at least show off what I did. So, I got six armor boxes, I mean, ammo boxes, nine armor, 10 bandages, and I'm ready to absolutely destroy this arena. So, I guess let's commence the arena right now, because I want to absolutely destroy it. I need to save game first. You always got to save your game first before you go into this arena. But here we go. Let it roll. Where? Come at me. I swear I hear it right here. Oh! It's in the tree! I knew I heard it right there. I'm like, I hear it. Oh, that was crazy. Is this camp in the tree? I am wasting all my time. I'm messing up my mind. I only need someone. And I'd be ready for a sign. I'm ready for your touch. I'll never be that guy. Yeah, just sit there frozen like an idiot. I'll take that. Jeez. Oh, that's everything he gives me. I completed all of it. Whoa, okay. A golden chest. I've never seen that before. Move that in. Move that in. Boom. Wow. We beat the arena. I never knew it was just one more wave. I guess it makes sense that it's that hard then. The difficulty makes sense. It's just the stupid jamming guns and like the combat in this game is a little bit bugged, so it pisses me off extremely, but I love the game so I deal with it. I think that might be part of the early access thing, which I've actually never noticed something that bothered me in a game before. But I love the game so it doesn't matter. The game the game is too good already, so like it doesn't matter. I don't people whine and cry about those things and then they just like they say it's unplayable. No, I say you play this game regardless of it. You just have to deal with the fighting. Okay. It looks like we got this sexy chest. Oh my goodness. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> Imagine I did that and it was off the edge and it didn't float. Place. Look at that. That's awesome. I'm so excited about that one. 
Then we got another one of these guys. Alright, here we've only ever opened one of these, but you know, I will take it. And we got the silver chest, which initially I thought was the best one you could get, because I, I thought there was probably only two and then maybe a third one, but it looks like there's actually one, two, three, and four of them. I, I have an imaginary one right here for the uh, the dull chest, but that is so cool. I, I like the look of that one. I can't wait to open that one up. Now, how much of the 10, 14 of it? Yo, let's go. So I have 15 altogether plus one mineral and one rubber so that those are extra automatically which is nice chemical and organics you can make animal fat i never knew that what i need to collect more of that i we just learned some we just learned some valuable things so now i can get animal fat easier and now i need i actually need some resources for once which is exciting for a long time, I didn't need resources because I used up everything. Okay, now that we're past the bombs, I can do this. Oh, there's a train. There's a train that I can loot. The trains are so good. I know earlier I got motion sickness at one of them, and oh boy. Watching the recording back, I was starting to get sick again. <laughs> I, and the thing was, it wasn't because I was getting motion sickness because of the game. It's because I could see that I was getting sick, and I, I was refilling it. I can see myself getting sick, and my brain's just like, wait. If you see yourself getting sick, you feel sick, right? And I was like, no, nah, that's not how it works. Stop doing that to me. Oh, yeah. Look at all these resources. We're just getting loaded. Fully loaded. Oh. Oh, yeah. Look, these are just so nice to get to. I mean, look at all this juice. I don't even know how I'm able to hold all of it, to be honest. This is so nice. Especially, like, when you run into, like, ten of these in, like, one go. Though That's always extra nice, too. Okay, I don't need any of the other mushies. All this metal easily grabbed. I love it. I love it. You love to see it. You love to see it. I would like us to go medium speed at least. How many times am I going to press jump on my space bar for it to not move? Oh my goodness. I can't believe I didn't grab that. Six metal scrap out of that. I like how those all only have like one thing in it now. It used to have like a bunch of different stuff, but it's all the same now. Which is kind of cool. Oh! Time to fight, I guess. Oh, of course I can't shoot through that. That's fine. Uh, there's so many right here! Okay. They're gone. Is that it? Oh, there's no one shooting. If I could hit my shots, the shotgun, bro, like, come on. Okay, well, that was a fast battle. He just went in here and crushed them like they were nothing. <laughs> Weird. Let's go see if it has anything fancy on it. Change. This thing. Is this mine? This isn't my gun. This is the gun he had. It does have a gold part on it. I'll take that. Um, that is a core frame. Um, let's just rip it apart. Golden grip. Look at this. Almost a full gold gun. Now, do I like that better or do I like that better? I like that stock better. Yes, I do. Is that it? Did I really carry everything like that? Okay, let's rip that last gun apart. And it's this gun right here. Purple barrel. Oh, it actually looks like a cool gun. Hold on. Let me let me hold it. Let me hold this. 
I'd like to hold this guy right here. Oh, it's a two-shot shotgun. I kind of like that. Change this guy. Absolutely decimate it to nothing. <laughs> I love just being able to rip them apart. Be like, yeah, everything's gone. Oh, yeah, there is one thing I just realized I messed up with. I do want this thing going faster, though. I'm going to go medium speed again. There's a lot of metal right here. Why does I have to put it in my hands like that? Oh. I just realized how close we were to those big things. Okay. That, that, that made me feel weird. I thought they were far away and then I realized how massive they were. Okay, okay. Oh, there's that beast out there. I would really love to go out to that beast. I want to go meet it. I want to go and meet it. The only thing is, is I don't... So far, I haven't had a possibility to do that because there has been no path to get out there to him. Okay, I've clicked it six different times. Okay, here we go. I don't see the blue fire. There's no blue fire at this one. Wait, that's actually kind of freaky. Is there going to be something weird that happens? There's no blue fire. Is it because I have the view distance turned down? Maybe that's it. I'll keep going, game. Oh my goodness, it's so annoying that it doesn't want to fire sometimes. It's the worst thing. It, I swear, it's the absolute worst thing. It makes me want to punch my computer screen out. Oh, there's the blue fire. Now I see it. I was it hidden? Usually it's super easy to see. Why is it different? Well, usually the blue fire is right there. It's up there. There's something different. There, I, I'm telling you right now, if something crazy doesn't happen, then you can call me the Tooth Fairy. The black hole behind it is perfectly centered. Is, uh, am I wrong that the fire is usually right here, not up there? What's my inventory look like? It's absolutely jammed back. Okay, I do think something different is going to happen. I'm going to go store stuff as fast as I can. This is going to be crazy. I, I can feel it. I can feel it. Whoops, here we go. It's going to be something crazy. I just, I'm feeling it. There's only one side! Something's not quite right. It seems even darker than usual. I was right, there is something different. Hold on, okay, that means I really do gotta store some stuff. Hold up, hold up. And I can't even build on my train like I was wanting to. Cram this wood in here. Oh boy, oh boy, okay, okay. Hopefully I don't need armor plates or anything, because I'm gonna kinda go in without. There's no train building station. It's one-sided. The fire was different when we were approaching, so... See, you don't get to call me the Tooth Fairy now. Now if you call me the Tooth Fairy, I'm gonna hunt you down. No, I'm kidding. Um, but... Ammo. I'm thinking maybe I put my... My, uh... This away, and I bring both my guns. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, I got seven ammo for my flamethrower. Let's look around. What's around over here? What's this? And we have a golden chest and everything. Okay, hold on. Now let's investigate this new area that I have not seen before. That no one's ever seen before. We are the first to adventure this facility. Not even the people who built it has even seen this place. Not even the developer. <laughs> okay, I'm done with that nonsense. Yeah. Keep my shotgun out that's full of golden attachments. I should have probably repaired my weapons before coming in here. I'm gonna pop my fancy armor plate. Hmm. Everything is so desolate. The perfect place for you to hide. Or to hide something. What if the scientist is here? 
What is this? What are these markings? Okay, I can't read none of that. Okay. <gasps> it's one of those little things. Can I get it? Can I take it? I feel like I should keep my pistol out, actually. Don't feed the monsters. Okay, let's go check. Oh, I just realized what this door looks like. What? Please don't be something insanely crazy that I don't need to see right now. Yeah, there's another one. Why is this seeming like Nordic stuff? Like, these are Nordic symbols and stuff like that. Are you all right? At least they look like it. Looks like security They're styled the similar, door. but they are slightly different than mechanism. Nordic. Hmm. By the way, one of the runes went out. Okay. Oh, those are some nice legs. Oh, okay. Are you is this tur this is turning into Outlast? I don't even feel like I'm playing Void Train anymore. I don't know what kind of craftsman lived here, but he had bad taste in figurines. Junk, not a work of art. Almost like what Rofimo draws. <laughs> what Rofimo draws? Find a way to open the door like this right here. It always says find a way to open the door, but then like... But then like the game's like, oh, it was this option the whole time and it doesn't tell me. Is that actually how I do that? I was shooting that one earlier. See, it doesn't activate certain things until you're ready, because I would have done that already and been, like, ready. Whoa, haunted chair! Let's interact with it. Oh, I just fixed it. Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm happy the chair was telling me it was haunted. But I don't think there's anything good waiting inside. Whoever put the protective runes on the door is obviously hiding something in there. What? Into the dark ether? Bro, this is Cold Wars. Huh? I mean, what the hell was going on? Did, did, the, did the narrator just drop an F-bomb on my family-friendly channel? <laughs> I mean, it's not the first time that's been on my channel. I've wait, played wait. some horrendous games so or played with some horrendous the friends. Scientist? He's been hiding in here the whole time? Okay, you're saying some weird stuff, but I don't know. I can't see this this light the, these words are super super tiny, but I'm gonna try to read them. The New Light Corporation has launched a new research and development unit. We are particularly proud of the professional and productivity staff. The best minds in the planet have decided to join the project and not just move towards the future, but create it. The official announcement states, Our inside sources tell us that the project is truly unique and the lab's equipment have no analog in the world for decades to come. What specific goal the NL wants to achieve with this innovation unit? Reported, however, about this further exploring unique rocks and natural resources that were found in the company geological survey last year. Read more about the lab in the next issue. And then it shows that. That is so hard to see. Some of the words I couldn't even see the letters on there are so tiny. What is this all about? Dragon stuff? That's actually kind of cool. Ruins. Vikings. Okay, so they are trying to do Viking ruins. I don't know why they didn't actually use real Viking ruins then. Oh wait, those ones look like These real ones. Yeah, those ones are, I believe. I heard Maybe I was just wrong about the first man. ones, but they just didn't look right. It says that there was a god who drew his power from an eternal waterfall. The water made him the I might be able to read that at the bottom left if it's actual words. Because I know how to write that in it. Waterfall was full of darkness. It's weird, I know how to write it, but I don't know how to read it, so if I am to read it, I have to read it slowly. The wise foretold the destruction of the waterfall, for all things have to come to an end. And so it came to be, and the stream dried up. For seers are never wrong, but the god was not foolish, so he hid some vials of the water somewhere in the void. 
Many brave ones went to seek out these vials in order to wield that power. Hmm. But no mortal has ever succeeded as far as I remember. Who knows what will happen to anyone who dares to drink from those vials? Well, that was into that. So the scientist is planning to find those vials. I'm a little rusty, so I'm not even going to attempt to read that. Oh, here's something. I don't know what he was trying to accomplish with this ritual. Don't touch anything. Proceeds to shoot it. A lot of books here. I like this space void. What if there was an area with my train I could go to? Oh, oh that's actually really weird. Oh, oh my goodness, that door's freaking me out because it's it's one of those ratchet and clank portal doors. It says touch nothing. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> what? This whole place looks like it's about to fall apart. It's too late now, you screwed up. Well, of course, of course. Why listen to me at all? I'm just a weird voice in your head. Let's the door's gone! What? Whoa, it's like we're going somewhere in the void. Critical overload. Oh, okay, I just realized I wasn't actually stuck in there like I thought it was. It says we need to get out of here. Hold on, I wasn't paying attention, I wasn't paying attention. Don't kill me, I got six seconds left. No, stop switching the gun, just run. Is this whole place collapsing? It is going down. The whole thing is collapsing. What? Depot boosters activation. Good thing my train has teleportation capabilities or I would have been fried in it. I was not making it out of there in time. Remember when I said things were really bad? Or when I didn't? It doesn't matter. Forget it. It was okay then. It's all but dark in here. it's really bad. <laughs> it's so creepy. What? What's happening? Are we... Wait, we might not be able to leave the void. We might not be able to leave well, into the void. On the whole, these are long gone creatures of darkness. Wait, what's Just at the back of the survive. train? Are there monsters in here? They better not be damaging my train. Oh, get on top of the train, game! I can't see. My gun's not shooting, it's already jammed. What is going on? This doesn't even seem like Void Train anymore. This is crazy. What the? I was not. I was not mentally prepared for it to be this crazy. That was pretty bright. What are we gonna do about it? Think about it tomorrow, maybe. Hmm. Well, look how if dark that place is. This whole thing just shut down on us. Okay, we're just gonna have to stop the train here for a second. Oh boy. I. What am I supposed to say about that? What? Like. I don't even. I, I don't know what happened. We were in a pocket dimension, which we've been in pocket dimensions before, but a pocket dimension inside a pocket dimension inside of a pocket dimensions thing right here. 
and ancient Nordic rune stones and Elder God and a booby trap that started decollapsing everything and then caused weird demons to come out of another void that we've never been in. Like a dark void, like the dark ether. Like, what the heck? There wasn't even anything in there to, like, customize my boat or anything. So I kind of missed out on getting into a void thing where... It says, to be continued. Continued the adventure. Is that the end of the game for, like, the story aspects? Don't tell me that's the end of the game for the story aspects. No way. It says, to be continued. Hold on. There's no way. You can't tell me the game. the game's over. Until they update it further. There's no way. Continue the adventure to be continued. So do we? Do I just move forward and then it, it's not the end? We'll still move forward. I hope that's not the end. But that was absolutely insane. That was like super crazy. So if that was and that was a that was a pretty good finale right there. But I feel like I don't know. Okay, I, I want this thing to be dead. What is this thing doing? What is this thing doing? There, I replaced my whole gun. And look at this place we're in. This place is like a shattered reality with this nice orange till to it. That is all oh, on my other monitor. It's like a golden till. Or like the, the colors are so vastly different on that. Whoa, wait. Am I? Okay, sorry. I was talking and it was just... It, I didn't see much movement on there because the screen's smaller, but... Oh, it looks so nice in here, though. I like this orange area. Look at the lighting just right here. It's so cool with the shadows coming in like that. This game would be so cool in VR if there's like a nice VR headset that processed it as well as what I can see right now. I do want to do a little bit of research and see if it's actually over. And I am going to continue. Um, I just know that that's a good spot to end it is what I'm trying to get to. That was absolutely crazy. It leaves me wondering what else this game has. Because this game just keeps on giving. Every time you play this game, you go a little bit and you're like, okay, I think i kind of seen everything it's going to be. And then it throws out a whole new item and way to play. And then you're like, okay, wow, this is crazy. And then you play a little bit and you're like, okay, I think this is about the gist of it. That's probably the last thing I get, right? And then boom, a whole other thing that changes the way each level plays. And then you're just like, what? And then you, you keep playing and you do a bunch of stuff. And you have all the research done and all that nonsense, right? And then you keep going and then all of a sudden it throws demons from the dark ether coming after you and a collapsing gateway. Like, that is just, okay. I love this game. This game is super good. Anyways, I gotta cut it here because I can't. I don't, I don't want to make my videos 30 minutes long. I'm already pushing them to 20 minutes when I wanted to make 10 minute ones, but... Anywho, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and adios amigos. And I'm going to continue here and see if there's anything else there is. But for now, you'll just have to wait and see.